Well, so it's finally here. We got the full album drop on the Homie Alpha Ties channel. We about to check out the uh, Stone Sober uh, EP that features uh, the Homie Simple. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, shout out to both Tyler and Simple. And uh, I can't wait to take a deep dive into this. I'm sure y'all can either. Hence why you're here. The first intro. Yo, what is good, Alpha Team fam? It is your boy, Jason JV, saying welcome to another album review. And yes, this will be um, a straight-up album review. We're going to do uh, pretty much almost every track, with the exception of two, because I already did uh, a reaction slash review of two of the songs off of this EP. So, uh, yeah. So, the, all the remaining songs that I have not heard, and I have not heard the album all the way through, even though I do got my copy... One sec. 12 seconds later. As I mentioned, dude got my copy of the EP right here. And yeah, have not played it in the car yet. Have not heard it all the way through. I wanted to hold off. I did, however, hear one uh, new track via Alpha Tyler's uh, live streams. So, uh, yeah. I think it's the wobbling one. I could be wrong. We'll find out when we get to it. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and we're going to kick things off. I already have it pulled up here. Uh, this is the, this song is simply called Smoke With Me, and uh, yeah, can't wait to get into this one, I'm sure y'all can't either, so without further ado y'all, let's go ahead and kick this album review off with Smoke With Me, again from the boys, uh, Alpha Tyler and Simple, without further ado, like the hey hey. <laughs> I think I, I like where this beat is going. It's got more of that, that party type vibe. I think I'm going to dig this. Let's go. Smoke that green. All right. Pretty sure that was simple right there. Like the energy uh, simple brought into that. Personal opinion, personal preference. I wish we had that energy in Black Magic. You blew it. I'm just saying. But anyway. Come and smoke with me. Smoke that green. Come and smoke with me. Smoke that green. Come and smoke with me. That you wanna come and smoke with me I'm an ape in the tree with the stake shit Only roll the fingers when I roll the green And I strip a whole branch when I grab for leaves Alright, alright So far I'm liking the energy that Simple is bringing to his verse um, Simple has been doing a great job um, Really bringing in that fire You know what I'm saying That energy into these tracks That the boys have been working on uh, with, this, with this album Or with this EP so far so yeah, I'm definitely liking the energy. Let's go. And then I strip a whole branch when I grab for leaves. Choke the trees like Mary Jane in the sheets. Put the ring on its finger, kept smashing beats. Wish the vocals were just a slight bit higher. But again, that's personal preference. So far though, it's still a, still a solid track so far. And I think the mix is just a little bit better on this track too. Smoking out to weed because I need the weed so I can write another verse that about you. Get a revolutionary with the visionary dropping like a nuka cherry on the very day we're getting right. Me and Simple come up with the lemon berry bubba and the chocolate cherry shit to keep you rubbing on the miles. And I see the ID, steps to your IV, pump shit steadily, killing you a lot. And of course, the Brody, hey Brody, is um bringing in that, that energy, you know what I'm saying, that my man is known to bring, you know what I mean, especially on this EP from what I'm hearing so far. You know what I'm saying? I'm definitely liking the dynamic between Tyler and Simple. I like how, they, how they're bouncing off of each other. Come and join my army. They can never harm me. Help me kill this blunt and we will march to their demise. Smoke that green. Come and smoke with me. Smoke that green. Not sure how I'm feeling about this hook. I, I don't hate it. 
But I can't say I'm a fan of this hook either. I don't know. I'm, I'm very torn on this hook. Because to me, it's too simplistic. And I mean, I get it. I mean, it makes sense given with this kind of beat. You know what I mean? It's got that party type beat. So, you know, you want to do a hook that kind of goes with that with, with that with that flow of the beat. I get it. Doesn't make me any more of a, of a fan of it. But like I said, I don't hate it, though. I'm just I'm very mixed on it. Come and smoke with me. Smoke that cream. Come and smoke with me. If you wanna get really fucked up, I mean beyond belief, then there's no better place to look. Take a look here at all this green. Roll it up and take a puff. Hold that shit down. Pass it to me. Okay, I like what Simple is doing here. I'm pretty sure that's Simple that is doing that harmonic piece right there. I hate to harp on black magic, but I'm going to do it because I'm an asshole like that. But anyway, um, I think it's simple approach that black magic hook with this energy. I think you guys would have got a much more desirable result. Now, again, personal preference. That's just my opinion, though. You know what I mean? I do respect and appreciate the fact that you guys stand by the creative decisions you made with that song. I'm just saying, again, for personal preference, for me, you know what I'm saying? This energy that Simple is bringing on this harmonic piece, I think maybe if you approach that Black Magic hook the same way, I think it would have given you guys a much more desirable result. You know what I'm saying? That's just me, though. But I do like what he's doing here. I do like the energy that the boys are bringing here. We're not done yet. Let's go ahead and finish this off, and I'll give my overall final thoughts on this one. I do feel like for sure the vocals on that harmonic piece do should be up a notch. You know what I'm saying? Um, the verse was fine. The verse was loud is definitely louder than this harmonic piece from Simple. Um, it's very obvious when you go back and listen to that Simple verse and then come back to this piece. It's very obvious that this is a little bit lower than that Simple verse. I feel like this should at least be just as loud as the verse. You know what I'm saying? If not, maybe just a little bit louder. But Again, that's a personal preference. Smoke that green. Come and smoke with me. Smoke that green. Come and smoke with me. Smoke that green. Come and smoke with me. Smoke that green. Alright y'all, so that was uh, Alpha Tyler and Simple uh, with Smoke With Me from the Stone Sober. Definitely going to match the like on this one because overall I do like mm -hmm. the song. Let's go ahead and get like some of the negatives out of the way. I do feel like there's still an issue you know, with the volume and the mix um, at times. Um, I feel like Simple's verse, again personal preference is just my own personal opinion you guys are more than welcome to disagree you know what i'm saying so as long as you don't come at your boy sideways then there won't be any problems i'm just saying but anyway uh yeah simple's verse i feel like it can come up just one one notch uh that harmonic piece he did can definitely come up maybe about a notch or two um and i think it would have been a much more desirable result as i mentioned earlier um and really, that's the only negatives I, I have against it. Um, for the positives, I love the beat. I love the energy that uh, the guys brought on this one. Uh, definitely one of the better songs. I would still say um, Stand Still is still like my number one favorite so far from what I've heard. And um, Black Magic is still my least favorite of uh, the two that I've already heard. Uh, so I would rank this one in between. Uh, Stand Still and Black Magic. Um, it's definitely a close second. It's definitely one of the better songs I've heard on this EP so far. And we still got, but don't go anywhere, guys. We're not closing it out here. Uh, we still got to get on to the next track. So let's go ahead and uh, let's do just that. 20 minutes later. All right, y'all. So we are on the next track. This one is called Into the Bar, and apparently it's a skit. It's a two minute skit, apparently. But anyway, let's go ahead and check this out. 
Man, that black magic's got me feeling wild right now. I need something to eat. Not me. You blew it. What about you? Yeah, let's go grab a bite to eat. What's open? Um, there's that new pub that opened up on Main Street. You want to go check that out? I heard they got a bomb sloppy Joe, dog. Yeah, let's do it. I could probably use a couple of drinks, too, if I'm being completely honest. That sounds fire. Let's do it, Bubba. Let's do it. Yo, you going to have some drinks with me? Oh, yeah. All right, cool. All right. <laughs> I see what y'all trying to do, but I wish you guys would have. The, the acting on here, I feel like could be better. I mean, I feel like the stuff that you guys are doing here is is, is kind of forced. I, I, it doesn't come off natural. You know what I mean? I feel like this is like heavily scripted. I think, um, I don't know if you guys you know, just kind of came off more natural with it, without a script, you know what I mean, talk to each other like you normally would, I think it would be a much better result. Hey, y'all know me by now, I'm that great A asshole, you know what I'm saying, bruh, I'm gonna I'm a, I'm a be that dude, and plus, yo, I can't be biased, alright, I'm just saying, I can't be biased, I'm not a yes man, I'm here to give my honest take on this, you know what I mean, some of y'all may like it, some of y'all may not, but, that, that's okay, you know. I, I I'm never been one to do what is popular. I always like to keep it a hundo. So, y'all knew what you got yourselves into when you signed up on your boy's channel. I'm just saying. Here we are. Let's get out real quick. See, especially that part. I don't need instructions. Okay, I know y'all about to get out the car. You got the doors opening up. That's too much. You don't need that. Mm. Man, can't shake this roller coaster, dog. I keep jumping between being on top of the world happy and being sad thinking about the world. You'll be good once you get a drink or two in you. Yeah, hey, you're right. You're right. All right, let's get in here. Let's see what's up. Again, I'm sorry, man. This is... This the acting could be better. I'm just saying. Ah, uh, what do you think? You want to just go sit at the bar? <laughs> Alright, cool. A couple of spots over there. Hey, what can I get you guys to drink? Two shots of makers. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get the same. I got one for each of us, Bubba. Oh. Mine can be the next round, I guess. <laughs> Alright, cilantro, brother. Cilantro. Okay, I do like the uh, cilantro part. That that felt a little natural right there. <laughs> See, I told you we were gonna need another round. Mm. Maybe some cardio up next? Yeah, you're right. That'd be dope. Oh shit. Look at this man. This thing wants to jump into the next one already. Okay. <laughs> Let's hold our horses now. Look at me, man. Now, now y'all got me doing that. You blew it. Breath. Alright, so I'll say this while I while I'm trying to get this shit straight right here. Because apparently y'all y'all is breaking the internet with this. Um Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold your horses. We'll we'll get to you in just a sec. So, I do like what you guys are trying to do with the skit. My only biggest real nitpick on it is just that it just didn't come off natural. You got some, you know, extra instructions as to what's going on and what you're doing. Yeah, let's, let's, let's get out real quick. We don't need to do that, bro. You have the sound effects with the doors. I can hear the doors opening. I can hear them close. You know what I'm saying? And that's all I need. I know exactly what you're doing there. You know what I mean? I don't need y'all to insult my intelligence with what's going on. You know what I'm saying? As far as like when y'all went in and you're looking for a place to sit, okay, fine. You know what I'm saying? But again, though, I kind of feel like th with the way that you guys are delivering these lines, though, and you're trying to act out this scene, it just, I don't know, it feels too heavily scripted. Like you guys, it felt like you guys were more concerned about remembering your lines more than just 
you know, giving that feel, that vibe that you are doing what you're actually doing. You know what I mean? Whether you're driving or being at the bar or whatever. You know what I mean? Like, I, I, I want to feel like I'm there with you. You know what I mean? By like, how would you talk to me? You know what I'm saying? If this wasn't a scene, if we were actually, you know, going out and we're hanging out at the bar, chilling, drinking or whatever, you know what I mean? Even though your boy quit drinking. Um, yeah, it's just, it, it, it just kind of came off a little too forced, you know what I mean? And I feel like you guys are more concerned about remembering your lines rather than just, just, just feeling it, you know what I mean? I don't know. It, it came off, yeah, I think too, too scripted is the best way to, to really give off the kind of vibe y'all y'all was setting for that piece. But anyway, look at this, man. Y'all is breaking my computer and the internet with y'all shit. I'm trying to get this thing straight. This might take a while. Several bad puns later. All right, y'all. So after some many um, painstaking minutes, I'm trying to get this shit to line up. Bruh. Y'all making me work really hard for this one. I'm just saying. You blew it. But anyway, uh, the next track that is up on deck is going to be Let's Get Drunk. And again, uh, for those of you in the back who don't listen very well, this is off of Alpha Tyler and Simple's uh, Stoned Sober uh, EP. And uh, yeah. Next song, like I said, it's up on deck. Let's Get Drunk. So let's go ahead and do the same thing. Um not a fan of the fact that it's only one minute and 55 seconds but anyway let's go ahead yeah okay the uh, skit was a little over two minutes long and this song is not even two minutes long you blew it all right anyway let's go ahead and get this over with This one, although it kind of gets gives me the smoke with me vibes, you know what I mean? Like the beats for smoke with me and let's get drunk to me sound very similar. I'm not saying they sound exactly the same or anything like that. I'm just saying they they sound very similar because they kind of have like that similar rhythm. They have that that similar feel to them, um, even though they're two di totally different topics. You know what I mean? One's about smoking, the other one's about drinking. I get that. Okay, I'm looking at you, Jake. I know you're gonna make that comment, um, but I'm just saying the the, the uh, sound though, the overall feel and the sound of this sonically, it sounds a little too similar. You know what I mean? I would have gone with maybe like a slightly more different beat. You know what I mean? So it just doesn't have like that same feel. It especially doesn't help when you got those two tracks going back to back as well. Well, technically not really because you got that skit in between, but still uh, two songs. You know what I mean? In a row that sound very similar. I mean, ah, I don't know. Anyway. Doesn't matter what we're drinking, fill my cup. Yeah, yeah. You can't kill the vibe because we don't give a fuck. Hello. When the DJ drops the bass, put your cilantros up. Cilantro! Four couple shots to start me off. I'll take a Megas Mark and a Bacardi Dark. Make a caribou blue if you know the song. And I don't mean a glass, man. I want the jug. Getting sauce to a toss when I bout the bar. God, everybody looking like the party's off Getting cars in and ours, putting miles on To put back in my place where the party's on Party till the sun comes up Let's get drunk Drink up. Doesn't matter what we're drinking Fill my cup oh, You can't kill the vibe cause we don't give a fuck no. When the DJ drops the bass Put your cilantro up cilantro. Take a couple drinks when it's party time Better when they're free but I'll drop a dime Wanna book me? Then you're gonna find That I drink a whole lot and it's more than wine with me, I'll put your liver in the impound. Bitch, it ain't free, but I'm a giver if you go down. Burn a little tree, but the liquor let your boy out. Nip him on the beat, then you know it can't be dry now. Alright, 
so that was uh, Let's Get Drunk off of Alpha Tyler and Simple's Stone Sober EP. Um, overall feel, overall vibe. I do like the energy, you know what I'm saying? I do like the vibe on this one. You know, I see what you guys are going for on this one. Uh, my only two negatives with it, too damn short. You blew it. I wish it was longer. That's what she said. I wish it was longer than that, than that skit that y'all poorly acted in. I'm just saying. Anyway, y'all, y'all know I got, I got to bust balls. Like I said, I'm, I'm an asshole. That's what I do. You know what I'm saying? Plus, I can't be biased. All right. So, if you're expecting a bias review, well, you know where the door is. Anyway. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, I'm having a time of my life with this one. <laughs> but no, uh, yeah, my, my only two negatives, I, it was, it was too short. Um, and the, the, the beat just sounded way too similar to uh smoke with me it just kind of had like that same feel that same rhythm um well similar rather than than same uh, just the only difference obviously is the subject matter the first one's about smoking um this one being about drinking and everything so you do have those two uh distinctions uh so let's not get that twisted overall i still think it, it's, it's a great sound um i think it was very well mixed um, not too many issues with the volume on this one. This one was definitely one of the better mixed songs, in my opinion. Um, would this be a favorite, though, or would it not be a favorite? I would say um, I would rank this one below Smoke With Me. So, so far, like my top three would be like Stand Still, Smoke With Me, and then Let's Get Drunk, and then, of course... Black Magic is dead last. Um, so yeah, overall not bad. I will give it a like out of love, out of support for the homies. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that's the only little bit of biasness you will get from me. You know what I mean? I will, I will still support it. I will still back this. You know what I'm saying? Um, but like I said, I, I got to be honest though with my reviews, guys. So if y'all are in your feels and you're going to hit the thumbs down or give me some negative comments, by all means, have at it. You know what I mean? Like I said, y'all know what you signed up for when you subscribe to my channel. Anyway. So, alright. Let's go ahead and see if we can line up the next song without any issues. Y'all. Y'all broken ass internet with your with your EP and shit. What the hell, man? So, Wobbling. I think this is the one, like I said, I heard recently on Tyler's Live. And I believe JP played it on his live, too memory serves I could be wrong but I know I've heard this one uh. and it's not gonna line up right for me great 20 minutes later and it's only an EP too but of course it's gotta be the most difficult album to review appreciate it fellas By the way, I like how you use the uh, the Justice League Unlimited uh, quote from Kevin Conroy, where Batman says, "I couldn't escape from any time, but I figure I stick around and keep an eye on you clowns." Two hours later. All right, this thing's in a fight with me. One eternity later. All right, so apparently. Y'all motherfuckers broke Google with your EP, making your boy work extra hard and trying to get this review done. You blew it. But that is the EP, you know, it, fuck it. I'm going to give it an F. Yeah. Nah, but for real though, I had to switch servers, man, because y'all broke Google. But anyway, uh, let me go ahead and continue on with this review. Uh, the next song that is up on deck is simply called Wobbling. And uh, yeah, I have heard this one before. Um, I've heard it through my phone, so I couldn't really give my overall honest opinion. So technically, this will still be a reaction. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get into Wobbling from Alpha Tyler and Simple, fresh off of their Stone Sober EP, which I highly encourage y'all to go hit them boys up and go get yourselves a copy. Let's go. Even though y'all making this review difficult for me, I still recommend that you know y'all, everyone else, go get a copy. Stick around to keep an eye on you, Won't you come and sit by the fire? Again, 
man, look at my, man, got, got my voice cracking too and shit. The hell, man. Anyway, <clears throat> again, I do appreciate the Justice League Unlimited um, Batman quote right there. You know what I mean? From Kevin Conroy. I could escape at any time, but I figure I'd stick around to keep an eye on you clowns. And, uh, yeah, uh, I was the one when I first heard this in Alpha Tyler's live stream saying, What in the Fort Minor? And apparently, according to Alpha Tyler, uh, I nailed that right on the head because they are going with a Fort Minor type vibe on this one, which I'm all about. So let's go ahead and get back into this. I gotta say already, I like the mix better on this one. This is probably gonna be my, my new number one favorite song. And yes, I can hear simple better on this one. So already, this is my, this is my new number one. No, no, this is my new number one. That's all, folks. Fuck this shit. I'm not. You blew it. Nah, fuck that. We, we, don't, we don't quit. Uh, gonna get back into this, even though y'all y'all got me all kinds of fucked up. But no, uh, I, I do like the energy on this one better. I do like the mix on this one better. This is definitely one of the cleaner mixes. Everything is sounding, you know, top shelf right now. So yeah, uh, so move over, stand still. This, this, this is my new, new uh, no, number one. But you know what, number two ain't bad. So anyway. Shout out to Nampy um, on this track too. Uh, I'm surprised y'all didn't have him a, a, as a feature. That that would have made more sense. I mean, how, how you gonna shut my man out and not have him on this track? Bruh. This would have been a better track to put him on too. I'm just saying. How you got the uh, mutsy laugh in there too. You know what I mean? Talking about that. <laughs> I can't do the whistle. I don't know. It sounds like, like a freaking monkey right there. But you guys get the idea. I did my best. Bruh. I can't do every voice. I'm just saying. Because I'm the only fucking real one. In the dang bomb. Atmosphere is fractured here. This Hennessy is fucking clear. The man gave me a fucking tear. This bitch can't even grow a beard. Guess the crew is fucking weird. I never see him really. But somehow it's all a fucking year. I, I feel bad for the poor soul who can't grow a beard. I mean, shit. They, they they even close it off with the mutsy laugh, so I I I'll give you I give you a bonus points for that one. You know what I'm saying? Right. So yeah, um, really no no negatives on this one. I I like this one. Pretty much everything about this I liked. You know what I mean? I love the energy on this one. I definitely love the mix. It's definitely one of the better mix songs. The volume on this one was better. You know what I mean? I can hear everything perfectly on this one. 
Um, I really like that beat. It definitely is a Fort Minor, Fort Minor uh, style beat. So yeah, it, it definitely this it, it the overall structure and presentation definitely gives off that Fort Minor vibe, which I do like. You know what I mean? And uh, shout out to Fort Minor. I wish that they they would they would drop another album. You know what I'm saying? I mean, bruh, because you know that one Fort Minor album just ain't enough. What the hell, Mike? I'm just saying, my guy. Anyway. <laughs> Yeah, man. Now, now, now I want to go and listen to that Fort Minor album, man. Bruh. But anyway, <clears throat> we, we still got more of this uh, Stone Silver EP uh, to get through. Uh, hopefully with, with this browser, you know what I mean? It'll, it'll be nothing but smooth sailing from here on out. One can only hope. Although I probably just jinxed myself. But anyway, <clears throat> yeah. This is definitely my new number one favorite. Stand Still is my number two. And then... Um, Smoke with me will be number three, um, and then the Let's Get Drunk will be number four, and no matter what, Black Magic gonna be dead last. So that should be a given now at this point. Um, but anyway, <laughs> if you guys want my overall thoughts on uh, Standstill and Black Magic, I will have the uh, the the entire reaction playlist on the end screen. You guys can get my thoughts there. You know what I mean? Um, Black Magic, the Black Magic review is not pretty. So be prepared. I'm just saying. Um, but yeah. Wobbling, I really like this one. Definitely my, my new number one. And apparently nine people agree with me on this one. And, oh yeah. I'm not signed in, so I can't hit that like. But you, you see me try to hit that like. Yeah. All right, y'all. So the next track that we have up on deck is Time to Smoke. And this better sound different than um, Smoke With Me. You know what I mean? And it better sure as hell sound different than Let's Get Drunk. I'm just saying. Anyway, let's go ahead and get into this one by liking the hit hit. I gotta say, I like the intro to this beat. It's giving me like early ICP vibes. So a little bit of twisted vibes as well. Take a puff and pass it to me. We get all the bud you need. It's time to smoke. Sticky trees is the only thing I need. And maybe a rapper three. It's time to smoke. Chopping heat, twist up a couple treats. Bring them later, please, because it's time. Okay. Mix is better on this one, too. I don't know, but I mean, and the volume is better on this one, too. Inhale it deep, choke it back up to breathe, then pass it off to me, cause it's time to If we're talking smoking green, then we're chopping a couple trees, and I ain't looking to be teased like Mary Jane in the knees. Give me weed, no stems or seeds, they need it clean, take the big bud, maybe cross with some D's, got the good plug, and the G is cheap, I'll take a good tug. Now I ain't talking about she, but if she wanna get freaky, she already knows where to meet me. Pull the bitch up out my pocket, then we spark it up, you feel me? I need an ounce a week for the demon that's in my head, is screaming, need a couple dash. I wanna know where the hell I was when this was made, because this sounds like... The, the mix sounds like like my kind of mix. Like, this is probably how I would have mixed it. I'm just saying. To the clean up anxiety is a reason. Write a couple lines when I'm puffing up on a blunt or something. If I smell it in the air, it's like a did a bell and running. Roll it up, take a puff and pass it to me. We get all the bud you need. It's hard to Sticky trees is the only thing I need. And so I like what Simple is doing with the hook. It's got It's more of a rapping style hook. And then you got that demonic voice talking about the time to smoke. Hey, that wasn't a bad impression, if I do say so myself. I'm just saying. Anyway. <clears throat> uh, but no, I, I, I like that hook. Um, definitely one of the, the better hooks that I heard off of this EP. Maybe a rapper three, it's time to smoke. Chopping heat, twist up a couple treats. Bring them later, please, because it's time to smoke. Inhale it deep, choke it back up to breathe. Then pass it off to me, because it's time to smoke. Roll it up, take a puff and pass it to me. We get all the bud you need, it's time to smoke. Sticky trees is the only thing I need. It may be a rapper three, it's time to smoke. Chopping heat, twist up a couple treats. Bring them later, please, because it's time to smoke. Inhale it deep, choke it back up to breathe. Then pass it off to me, because it's time to smoke. Sometimes, man, I don't know. It's like I have a couple drinks and I'm ready to roll. Picking at my stash to see I'm running low and then I'm feeding him with the cash. Why man off a tire trying to be like your boy with the yay yay? So I can pack a fresh bowl. But just know that I do this right. I don't be smoking on the green unless you're rolling tight. No sticks, no beans. And if you pass to me, it better be top shelf or a hold a pint. Only brown thing I'm buzzing on will be the liquor that I'm drinking till I'm dead and gone. 
A day drinker that'll teach you chong And smoke cheech on the ropes like the king and kong Ping pong with the blunt tonight But don't be touching on my bottle unless you up to fight Duck water sparking up a light And then we run a full throttle hitting all the when we dry Hold on cause the song ain't done You know it's time for us to smoke a Well thank goodness the song ain't done yet you know what I mean? Man, this is probably one of your longest songs yet. It's almost three minutes long. Let's go. Let the edge be gone. So roll it up, homie, grab the bong, and then it's puff, puff, pass till you pass the sun. Up, take a puff and pass it to me. We get all the bud you need. It's time to Sticky trees is the only thing I need. It may be a rapper three. It's time to Chopping heat, twist up a couple trees. Bring them later, please, cause it's time to Inhale it deep, choke it back up to breathe. Then pass it off to me, cause it's time to Roll it up, take a puff and pass it to me. We get all the bud you need. It's time to Sticky trees is the only thing I need. It may be a rapper three. It's time to Chopping heat, twist up a couple trees. Bring them later, please, cause it's time to Inhale it deep, choke it back up to breathe then pass it off to me because it's time to smoke all right so that was time to smoke off of the stone sober ep from alpha tyler and simple um again i don't have any any negatives on this one i like the mix better on this one volume was better on this one um I don't know. It seems like the more we get into the EP, the better the mix is getting. Like the mix is getting pro is pro getting progressively, if I can get the word out, progressively better um, as we progress through this EP. I don't know if that was planned or not. I mean, it, it's kind of frustrating for me because I wish it was this clean all throughout the EP. Again, that's just me though, personal preference. You know what I'm saying? Overall, it's a solid EP so far. You know what I'm saying? Um, definitely some room for growth. There's definitely, you know, room for development here. You know what I mean? Um, definitely some, some growing pains, you know what I mean? That these guys are going to have to, you know, work through, um, for if they decide to drop another project or whatever, I don't know what, what they got lined up. Um, but yeah, I would say, um, shit, I can't remember the name of the last song we had to look at. I got that old man brain. I don't know what to tell y'all. I mean... Let's see. So Wobbling is still my number one. I would say Time to Smoke is my new number two. Sorry, Stand Still, but you are now my number three. Um, I'm not counting the uh, skit because it's a skit and not a song. And I'm ducking, I'm docking points out for that skit because it's longer than the song that was following it. Um, I'm sorry, but to me, that's just not a good look. I feel like a song should be longer than a skit. That's just me, though. Um, and then uh, let, let's see, where did I leave off? Stand still with my number three. Smoke with me is my number four. Um, let's get drunk is my number five. And then we all know where Black Magic stands with me now. Like I said, it should be a given now at this point. I want to hit the like, but I'm not signed in on this browser, and I ain't trying to do all that because um, I would rather do this on on Google. But anyway, uh, Google. But Google's like, not nah, fuck that, man. They 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 don't they don't broke me with this one. So let's go ahead, knock that one out of the way, and let's pull up. Quicksand. See, I'm drowning in the quicksand. Uh, for those of you who don't know that reference I made, that was a clockwork song, an old clockwork song. Can't go? Do this to clear out stuck poop fast. Fiber helps you poop, right? Nope. Look, I love y'all, but I ain't got time for no damn ads, you know what I'm saying? Especially ads about fucking shit. I mean, I'm just saying. All right, so the next one that is up on deck is Quicksand. This one features that dog, Stray. Hmm, okay. Interesting uh, feature choice. Just saying. Um, I can't wait to get into this one. I'm sure y'all can't either. Without further ado, like the hee hee. It's a shame that this song is only two minutes and forty five seconds long because I love this beat. This beat go hard. I 
Okay, already having issues with the mix. Volume on simple is too low. That needs to come up a notch. Y'all yeah, had it with the last two songs, and then you dropped the ball on this one on that end. I'm just saying. Never had direction. A coke fiend had a bottom feed. Okay, never mind. I take that back because I see what you did there now with the beginning of that verse. So I take back my previous statement. It was infectious with pipe dreams living on the streets. Try to find an exit, move light speed, take what I need. Active really reckless, you might think. No what I've seen. Fight these visions of blurry, they keep my stomach churning. Might be broken, I'm sorry, but no one didn't cause it. Right these poems are homage and said, I'll keep my promise. Lie free, homies are lost, I ain't forgot ya. Took a lot of change of reflection. I gotta say, I do love Simple's flow on this one. It definitely goes with this beat, man. Let's go. To keep from stepping back and took a couple gigs to get clean, but I'll still talk a weapon, never getting head up, cause it ain't up on the menu. Like you're looking at the local butcher shop and fish and veggies. Now I'll wake up at the butt and then go back to the lab and find myself up on the mic and then I'm back to the battle and turn my back to the rabble. And now I find I'm on a better path. Every single chance I come to wait, you know I'm gonna grab it. There was only so many days that I can keep this going. I don't know which way I should face. So when the blue will be watching out, it's not fucking place. This way they can not only when the bridge is bringing your weight. You better grip and hold it. There was only so many days that I can keep this going. I don't know which way I should face. So when the blue will blow me, watch it out, it's not fucking place. This way they can not only when the bridge is bringing your weight. You better grip and hold it. Sinking quick. I need a savior for the shit. Out of favor with the situation, major from my grid. I need a favor, help me quick. Every day I take a hit. Mental state is fading in. I'm just waiting for the end. Sick and fast. Feel that just a couple years back. I was falling on my ass. Had to make it settle fast. I was driving and at last started spinning with the mask. Yeah, I know you remember that. Every center has a past. Heard about it? Bet I live that out. Had to end it. All that pressure finally found me out. At my wit's end, I was truly fully burning out. Mental illness? Man, my world's still turning round and round. No comfort could yeah, I know what my man is talking about here. Talking about a situation. He said a couple years back. Okay, I don't know. I mean, he could be talking about something else, but I have an idea. If not something else, then I think I have an idea of what he's talking about. And I can see why that dog stray was, was chosen as a feature on this one. I'm not going to get too much into details. Just It's one of those things, if you know, you know. If you don't, don't worry about it. It ain't relevant anymore. Anyway. Be found, but you fully heard me out. Help me turn it all around. So now, as we're talking about how the sand just pulls us down, we just keep in mind just how much you rather pull me out. Help me turn my shit around. Quick, man. There's so many days that I can keep this going. I don't know which way I should face. So when the blue will blow me, why should I get so stuck in place? This way they can not hold me when the bridge is breaking your way. You better grip and hold it. There was only so many days that I can keep this going. I don't know which way I should face. So when the blue will blow me, why should I get so stuck in place? This way they can not hold me when the bridge is breaking your way. You better grip Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. It says Dog Stray was featured on here. So where was the feature? Was that was that him in the beginning of the song? I thought y'all was gonna have him rap on this. Yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of kind of um, bamboozled on this one. But anyway, um, my only negatives. I didn't hear that much of Doc Stray. <laughs> That's my only negative. Uh, positives. Mix is better on this one. I jumped the gun on Simple's verse. Um, I thought that that was like the way the way he kicked off that verse. Yeah, I don't know that it, that kind of threw me off. You know what I mean? So yeah, but then when he actually got got going, then okay, then it, it made sense and I understood. So. I, I do like the mix better on this one. Again, it feels like, you know, from the start to the end, it kind of reminds me of our LC4 uh, album review that Tyler and I did a while back. I'm just saying. But it seemed like the mix started out rough and then progressively got better. And again, I don't know if that was by design or not, but either way, I'm not, I'm not a fan of that. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, I... Overall, I do like the song. I like I love the beat on this one. That's what I'm saying. It's a shame it's only two two minutes and forty five seconds long. I wish it was just a little bit longer. And Dog Stray actually would would have had a verse on this one with y'all. Um, so yeah. But I mean, overall, yeah, it's probably one of the better sounding songs. This one will probably actually be my new number one because I really like that beat. Sounds like the kind of beat I would have rapped on. I mean, I'm just saying. Um, 
so yeah I would I would hit the like but again I'm not signed in I'm on a different browser trying to get this um, review done but I would definitely hit the like and uh, yeah let's go ahead and move on to the next one which will be the last one because the last two tracks would be um, Black Magic. Again, I already did a review of that. If you want my full thoughts, playlist will be coming up on the end screen. And I already did my uh, review of Standstill as well. Again, that review will be in the uh, playlist on the end screen. So if y'all want to go check that out, please, I'd encourage y'all to go do so. If I get my full thoughts on both these songs. So the last song, which is not a song, it's another skit. And this apparently this is only on the digital version. So if you got the digital version, then you had this skit. But and and again, look at this. The yeah, skit is almost three minutes long. How you have a skit that's almost three minutes long, and the majority of your songs? Never mind. I I already, I already made made that 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 complaint. I'm not gonna harp on it anymore. But anyway, let's go ahead and get this before I, I get really upset. This, this better be worth it. This one better have a better payoff than that last skit. I'm just saying. All right, y'all. So we are on the last call skit. And again, this is only available on the digital version exclusively, apparently, because that's it says in parentheses digital version. Um, but yeah, so as I mentioned, this one better be better than the last kit because it's damn near three minutes long. So there better be a dope payoff or at least a very hilarious payoff on this one. Anyway, without further ado, let's, let's find out, shall we? So without further ado, like the hit hit, go. I see now what y'all is doing. So that one skit, that was the first part. This last skit, this is it picks up from where the last skit. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. I, I I see what y'all is doing. I see what y'all is doing. But still, my point remains: better have a good payoff. <laughs> Thursday night where the bourbon runs Raise a glass and let's have some fun Come gather around all you thirsty ones And share with us your story Soon we will all be home Some getting drunk while the others get stoned Bring along everyone you know Our door is always open Pull up a chair, it's time for the show Open up a bottle or pack up a bowl One in the books and so many untold We're bound to last for glory Soon we will all be home Some getting drunk while the others get stoned Bring along everyone you know Our door is always open da 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 The night grows old and the tales are told New friends are made and the discord grows Thursday night is the family home Don't bring to us your folly Soon we will all be home Some getting drunk while the others get stoned Bring along everyone you know Our door is always open The show's winding down but the night's still young Requests are closed and reactions are done Come to the disco for after party fun That's where you'll always find us Soon we will all be home Some getting drunk while the others get stoned Bring along everyone you know Our door is always open Soon we will all be home Some getting drunk while the others get stoned Bring along everyone you know Our door is always open Soon we will all be home Some getting drunk while others get stoned Bring along everyone you know Our door is always open What the fuck are we doing here? <laughs> no Alright I will say the payoff on that skit Was definitely worth it I like what y'all did there You kind of did like an Irish drinking type song there 
You know what I mean? A little, little, little march rhythm going on there. I, I like what y'all did there and everything. It's cool. Um, so yeah, overall, my overall thoughts on the EP, I, I think, it, like I said, I think it's overall a pretty solid EP. It's a good first impression for since this is, you know, really your first project coming out the gate. Um, but like I said, there's still some things though that I would have polished up. Again, this is personal preference. You know what I mean? Um, this is just my, my opinion. You know what I mean? The, the mix could, I feel like could be better all throughout this EP. Um, so with the inconsistent, um, uh, with, yeah, so the, in, the inconsistent mix is really my only negative against this. Um, you know what I mean? There were some volume issues on some tracks that did improve on the latter end of this album. Um, and I feel like these were opinions that were given on LC4's um, album uh, that Tyler and I have reviewed uh, a while back. So, you know what I mean? Overall, that's, that's my honest take. Um... I do feel like Simple has gotten better with the rapping. He is um, emoting more in his music, uh, which is a plus. Uh, Tyler gave a solid performance. Um, I, I do like the features, although one feature was lacking, and we all know which one that was. That was Dog Strays. Um, I, I did enjoy, of course, Nampy, you know, being, being that he was also featured on this album. It's a shame that he was only on one song, and it's a song that, again, I'm not a huge fan of, um, but which I'm not going to harp on. I'm not going to beat on that to death, because um, I already made my, my feelings felt on that one. Um, but everything else, though, I feel like, overall, it's not bad. Could be better, but overall, it's not bad. I think it's solid. I highly encourage y'all, if you're rocking with the Alpha Team fam, you know what I'm saying, make sure y'all go support the homies, Alpha Tyler and Simple. Go pick up the Stone Sober uh, EP. Um, your boy is definitely glad that he got his bundle package. Um, I believe they're still doing the bundle. Um, what What's included with the bundle is an autographed copy, um, an autographed hard copy of the album. And I believe you get a digital copy as well because I got a digital copy. And then you get a autographed poster, which I have back there um, as well. <clears throat> so, yeah. Do, you, do yourselves a favor, go pick up a copy of the EP, uh, you won't be disappointed, again, um, I'm only saying what I'm saying, because again, I cannot be biased, I gotta be honest, I gotta give my, you know, my, my true take, because look, I don't wanna say these guys are flawless, I don't wanna say they're perfection, because when you do that, in my opinion, you're basically telling uh, these guys that, that they peaked and they're not gonna get any better, I don't like doing that, I like challenging, um, the artist that I care about, that I support heavily, because an artist is only as good as their next song. Meaning, you know, uh, all these things, all these issues that I'm addressing with on this current project or whatever song that I'm reacting to, if there's issues on it, it's best to address those. So that way, when they work on their next song, their next project, they don't repeat the same mistakes. You know what I'm saying? Um, because you, you got to give them that, that elbow room to progress, to evolve, to get better. You know what I'm saying? So when you're saying, oh, you know, it's fire, man, it's great, it's perfect. Again, in, in my opinion, you're, you're hindering that growth. You know what I mean? There's always room for growth. There's always room uh, for evolution. You know what I'm saying? Um, and yeah, so, so that's why, you know, Again, I can't be biased. I gotta be honest. You know what I mean. And if people want to hate me for telling the truth, that's fine. Y'all can hate me. Y'all, y'all want to be mad at me for telling the truth? Be mad at me too. It's all the way good. I don't care. You know what I mean. Um, I rather, I rather people hate me for being honest than love me for being dishonest. You know what I'm saying? Um, and that's just me. <clears throat> so anyway, with all that being said, guys, uh, yeah, overall, I'm with it. You guys are with it. Again, go support the homies. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this album review. Really hope you guys enjoyed uh, me giving my honest take on it. Um, if you did, y'all know the deal. Like, comment, share, and, of course, subscribe if you're new. Last time I checked, we are up to 62K.12 um, uh, subs. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, we are at 61.12 last time I checked. Or 62.12. That's what I'm talking about. 
Look at me, man. man I, I I quit drinking and smoking, man. And, and, and already, man, I got that I got that dummy brain going on. But anyway, uh, yeah, sixty-two twelve is where is where we were when I last checked. So uh, yeah, appreciate everyone uh, supporting the channel, rocking with the channel. Don't forget, uh, rather than having a link to a particular video, I'm gonna have a link to uh, this playlist. So you guys want to check out the EP before you buy um, the link for the playlist will be in the description down below in place of a video link so you guys can you know get a get a little preview get a little sample of what you're in store for um because i didn't go through every single song on this video like i said i left out two songs because i already had a look at those um so yeah uh, and don't forget while you're checking out that playlist link uh please by all means check out the uh, storefront links as well if you want to get some original jjv merch t-shirts bucket hats decals and all kinds of other goodies you know what i'm saying uh would really help out the channel so your boy can provide more uh video reactions slash reviews more album reactions slash reviews as well and uh also some more music of my own as well you know what i'm saying and uh yeah, I think I pretty much nailed everything. So with all that being said, it is your boy Jason JV. And y'all take care. Have a blessed one. I catch y'all next one. Peace, Alpha Team. Jason JV on YouTube. Uh, what's up with you, Jason JV? What up, Jason JV? I'm just sending love, peace, and blessings to you. Jason, you are my homeboy, my guy. Don't call me guy, pal. Don't call me buddy, pal. Much love to you, JV. Chris Calico. Cali, baby. Oh. What's up, Jimmy? My name's Jimmy Bass. I just want to have the next video with a little trick. Who's saying what's up, Jimmy? Keep your motherfucking head up. Uh, uh, I don't know why you're sad. If you're sad, you're sad. You're sad. You're happy. I'm going to be too happy. I'm going to be expecting shit. It's like when you curve all the time. So you ready to be on the swerve. So subscribe. Turn the little bell on. Hit that notification bell. Turn on the post notifications. And if you're not down with that, we got three words for you. Eat it. Yeah.